Alright, what's up you guys? Today we will be bringing you the UTEP being evacuated due to possible bomb threat, guys. That's right, a possible bomb threat. It's extremely close to April, and it's so hard to believe that a bomb threat is being, um, it's what is being shown right now. Um, the spokesman at the UT at the at the university said that it's just a security issue. They don't know what the threat was, and um, text messages text messages are indicating something else that it's a bomb threat. Why is the smoke spokesman saying this? Why not just flat out say the truth that yes, it was a bomb threat, and um. Um, some of um, people that I know that attend the university said they got school messages, like the actual university sending out the messages at 1:58. Um, everybody's reporting that the message was sent at 2 p.m. Now I don't know if you can see that 2 p.m. doesn't make sense. I don't know why they're reporting that. I don't know they're just making a they're just rounding off or whatever. But um, they um. People that I spoke to said that they did see police swarm before 2 p.m., which was weird. But the official Twitter feed from El Paso Times said that the cops did not show up until 2.32, 30 minutes to respond to this incident, which is weird. And also students reporting that there was already cops there before it was even sent out. Um, could it be a hoax? Could it be... A legit bomb threat what's the reason for this um, most likely I'm gonna say that of course it's gonna be a hoax but the thing is why now why today what's the motive of this why why even bomb the place um, some stories state that people were um, um, in the middle of class that um, Students were extremely afraid. Shit, I'd be fucking afraid. I'd be running out the fucking classroom and don't give a fuck about anybody else and just fucking run for it. But, um, they said that you should leave your belongings. Fuck no. Take all your fucking shit and get the fuck out of there. Um, here are some stories that, that are showing that students, the way their reactions and stuff. I was trying to obtain video, but there really isn't any video, just people walking. I mean, here they here they have um, just some dudes walking here on this, on this little picture here. I mean, I'd be freaking running. They said a lot of people were scared and a lot of people were running. Um, so I don't know if it's a conspiracy, what's going on at the school. I mean, this is an extremely serious thing. And for the freaking pigs to respond 30 minutes later that kind of sucks yo because what if there was an actual explosion and it's i mean they got to be more faster than that i mean it's fast but 30 minutes is a long time because it only takes like few minutes they should respond to that shit asap but my overall opinion on this is that um i hope everybody's safe out there um, I believe that they should close the school today, tomorrow, and even Thursday. Um, I, I don't have school on Friday, so I don't know if the university doesn't have school on Friday as well. They should just close it down for tomorrow, investigate a lot more. Even if it turns out to be a hoax, they should definitely investigate more. Um, I'm curious in where the message um, started from. I received the forward from one of my friends, but I want to know what who sent it out. Um, I don't know why they're reporting 2 p.m. here. When I have legit people that go to the school that reported it earlier, um, gonna try to attain video of the cops swarming the building, and basically everything that's at the university today has been postponed. Um, I believe they're just gonna reschedule it to the next day. I still wouldn't go to the school the next day if I do not get an update on this. All right, so that's just a small brief thing of the uni uh, University of Texas, El Paso or something. Um, that's the update for today. And everybody's hyped up all over on Twitter on this. A lot of people are joking around, saying that the ass grabber guy is coming back again. But this time with more vengeance. So that's my video for today.